Hey there guys, good morning. It's Carly. Welcome back to my channel or if you're new here, hi. It is currently about 10 past 8 on a Monday morning and I'm taking my car over to Huskisson for a service and because I'm going to sort of be stuck there with my car for a while, I figured that it would be a good opportunity to sort of do like a little bit of a staycation type vibe where I can show you guys around Husky, some of the main spots, my favorite places, eating, shopping, all the bits. So I packed myself a little backpack with a book and whatnot to helpfully, you know, pass the time. Unfortunately, it is a bit of a yucky day, but hopefully that works in my favor and means that there is not going to be as many tourists out and about. Oh my gosh, I can actually get my car started. Um, so yeah, grab yourself a cuppa and let's get into it. The mechanic that I booked into was out at the Woolamaya Industrial Estate, which meant that the first place that I came to on my journey in Tuskerson was the Jervis Bay Maritime Museum. And I got there pretty early in the morning. It was super quiet, very relaxing, and it was just me and the beautiful nature around. The Jervis Bay Maritime Museum is a fantastic place to go to, particularly if you have young kids. And they also have a mangroves walk, which leads to a lovely lookout of the lake. And it's just a nice place to relax and unwind. After the Maritime Museum, I started moseying into the Huskisson town and stopped by a few lovely places along the way, including the trading post, this nice little lookout, and also at Husky Pictures. I've never actually been to the cinema in Husky, but from Dave's reports, it is quite a boxy space because it is quite flat it does mean that you don't have the best view of the actual movie but could be a good place to go to if you need a little daytime adventure then on to husky main street and some of my favorite places now thankfully for me i did head in quite early in the morning and there wasn't many people in town at this point i was able to walk down the main street and just enjoy some beautiful spots in silence and serenity i then headed up to pilgrims husky and got myself a little breakfast which was this lovely juice I think it might have been the back beach juice and also a nice slice, which was very delicious. Sat down by the water and ate those. It's just started to rain again, but I'm back at the Lady Denman and I just picked up myself some lunch. I'm under this little pergola thing and I've got a lovely little view of the lake or dam, I suppose. While I eat my lunch, I had healthy this morning and now I'm going for taste. So I just got home and I wanted to show you guys a few things that I picked up from some of the shops in Husky. First of all, I got these really awesome dried flowers so i've got 
some cotton in there and a whole heap of other really pretty things. I've got a new vase come in that I think will be perfect for these. They're by the brand Esme and Flora and they were just from this little candle and flower shop in the main street. I also went to Aquatique, the surf shop, and picked up a few shirts for Dave, a few surf brand shirts. And then I ended up stopping into that white earth, which was filled with really awesome Australian natural, like skincare, hair care, body, like all beautiful stuff like that. And I picked up two things. I got this Salus. Um, charcoal purifying facial mask and I also got and I'm so stoked to try this it is by the brand Bopo Women and it is a halo hair drops with jasmine neroli and argan oil so very pleased of my purchasing efforts um, and also just had a great day because the weather wasn't that great it meant that Huskisson wasn't filled with tourists, which is a normal sort of uh, situation. It is quite a popular place. Just quickly, I wanted to mention some of my favorite spots in Husky, other than the places that I showed you guys today. So in terms of like breakfast and lunch, I love Pilgrim's, Main Deck, and Five Pigs, although Five Pigs, I think it's Five Pigs, not Three Pigs. I think it's five pigs, um, does tend to get quite packed. So if you do want to go there, they have fantastic breakfast food. I encourage you to get there early. Pilgrims is one with the best view because you can actually sort of see the water from there. Whereas the other two, you mostly just see the opposite side of the street. In terms of dinner, hands down, definitely wild ginger, but I also like the quarters. It's not on the main street. It's down one of the little side streets and both of the clubs are great if you want to go and just get a drink and sit down on the veranda and look out at the view. Fantastic on like a Sunday afternoon or a really nice sunny day. And the Taj restaurant, if you like Indian food, is also a great place to go. So Husky is pretty well bringing the goods when it comes to food and shopping, but then there's also a whole heap of other like little sort of hidden gems in there from the Lady Denman and the Mangroves Walk to it being the start of the White Sands Walk, which is a pathway you can take all the way back to Vincennia or even just keep going all the way to some of the great white sand beaches. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe down below. I have a whole heap of other videos exploring my beautiful surrounds and I'm sure there will be a lot more coming your way. I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your week and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys.